Assassin's Creed Shadows is just two months away, but Ubisoft's marketing has gone silent. With no trailers and a messy schedule for gameplay articles, questions arise. Is Shadows in trouble, or does Ubisoft have a bigger plan? The trouble with Shadows marketing began the moment Ubisoft delayed the game, moving it from November 15, 2024 to February 14, 2025. A three-month delay might not seem huge, but it completely threw off their marketing plans. The episodic developer diaries, something Assassin's Creed fans have come to expect, were suddenly left unfinished after the first episode. To make things worse, the second episode was accidentally uploaded on social media just after the delay's announcement. While it was quickly taken down, it only added to the confusion. But after that, the company went into complete radio silence. Fans were left in the dark for weeks until late November when Ubisoft announced they would be dropping four articles detailing Shadow's new changes and features. I even covered the first article, giving an extensive look at his stealth on the channel. You can check it from the link above. Naturally, the community assumed we would get one article every week, a pattern that seemed natural at first given the number of articles, but nothing came. Then we thought it might be bi-weekly, but now December 5th has passed, and there's still nothing. No updates and no explanations. This silence feels especially strange for a game as important as Shadows. Ubisoft has a lot riding on this release, especially following their recent studio shutdowns and setbacks. And yet, the only tangible marketing we've seen includes a Japan-exclusive pre-order bonus and a 40-minute speech by Mark Alexis Cote. Now, as interesting as Mark's speech was, which I will dive into in an upcoming video, it doesn't fix the larger issue. Ubisoft seems disorganized and unprepared. The lack of trailers, gameplay, and consistent communication is only fueling questions about Shadow's development. So what does this mean for the game? Is Ubisoft gearing up for a massive reveal, or is this chaotic marketing a bad sign? With Shadows just two months away, there's still a lot we don't know about the gameplay. That's unheard of for an Assassin's Creed title this close to release. Sure, the Game Awards is happening on December 12th, and I wouldn't be surprised if Ubisoft drops a trailer there. But the real issue isn't just about trailers, it's the complete lack of those promised articles and the missing dev diaries, which I assume they must have been replaced by the articles in question. When Ubisoft announced the articles back in November, it felt like the game's marketing had finally started, but here we are. As I've discussed with other Assassin's Creed creators on the topic, a logical timeline would have been weekly article releases, followed by a big splash at the Game of Wars, the rumored gameplay previews in mid-January, and finally, a launch trailer to seal the deal. No pun intended. Instead, we're stuck with few short clips from weeks ago that barely scratch the surface. If Ubisoft plans to release a handful of 10 second long clips from this game every month, then that would be the worst possible marketing for an AC game ever. What's even stranger is that nothing is stopping Ubisoft from releasing these articles now. Even if a trailer is planned for TGA, why hold back the written content? Delaying a game and leaving fans in the dark is usually not a good sign. Now, don't get me wrong, I fully support game delays if it means fewer bugs and a smoother launch, but for a game like Shadows, this silence could hurt more than it helps. So can this marketing mess still be salvaged? I believe Ubisoft still has enough time to turn Shadows marketing mess around, but they need to act fast. At this point, we still don't know how long they plan to take between releasing each article, but if I had to make a guess, the marketing push might ramp up toward the end of January. That's when the rumored gameplay preview event could happen, potentially shifting the narrative and wiping out much of the negativity surrounding the game. But here's the kicker. We still can't even pre-order the game. That could change soon, especially with the Game Awards on the way. If Ubisoft drops a major trailer during TGA and reopens pre-orders, followed by consistent gameplay showcases, it might restore faith in the marketing process. But let's be real, Shadows is shaping up to be one of the largest Assassin's Creed games in terms of gameplay mechanics, and Ubisoft has a lot to show. A deep dive trailer like the one Valhalla received pre-launch could do wonders in breaking down all the new features and giving fans a clear picture of what to expect. But more than trailers or articles, what Ubisoft really needs is clarity. If the marketing plan has shifted, just say so. Tell us upfront whether these articles are coming weekly or sporadically. Stop leaving fans in the dark. Sure, anticipation can create free marketing, but for Shadows, this unpredictability feels like it's doing more harm than good, especially given the mixed conversations around the game right now. 
Shadows deserve its moment to shine, because from everything we've seen so far, it could very well become one of the best games in the series in years. But the game needs room to be noticed, and Ubisoft has to create that space. So what do you think? Should Ubisoft ramp up their marketing now, or does this chaotic strategy somehow work for them? Share your thoughts in the comments below.